Uh, to be fair, the Yoshi could play better. Oh, yeah. Definitely. I definitely feel that. The, the, one the thing, egg rollout would. <laughs> the one thing I gotta say, though, is that watching a sheep chain grab a Bowser really is, like, hard to oh, take. Oh, yeah, that, that's, that's hard heartbreaking. Take, man. Like, that, that's heartbreaking. That's just like, did someone actually play test this? Like when you're when you're doing that, like come on. Whoa. Pretty sure Sakurai knew. Yeah, nice. Uh, that was a nice wall jump back here to get LXIX off the edge and uh, get K back on safe. Uh, LXIX playing a pretty good neutral game so far though. Um, as expected though, Fox does do a little bit better in neutral against Sheik just because his moves uh, like lower cooldown, a little bit faster moving. He's got the options. He's got the shine. He's got a lot better shield pressure too. Uh, so, really even game, and LXIX in a good position. K goes to the side platform to try to avoid a punish. LXIX does the scrubby forward smash. Um, back air. Great back air by K to seal off the stock. Most Foxes actually uh, are very afraid of doing side B when, like, on this stage in particular, because she just jumps out. Her foot, like, spans the universe and just kind of, like, slips you. Yeah, her foot covers, like, half the stage. Um, I'm surprised that uh, K didn't try to grab the edge there earlier, but... LXIX tried to be sneaky and grab the edge before him, but yeah, didn't quite work. LXIX needs to uh, lose lose the forward smash a little bit. It's not a bad option, but like it's so punishable if you mess up. All right, K and with the cross-ups. And combos. Oh. Okay, well, damn, we got down to... Still uh, worked anyways, so you know, I guess we take it, but... Oh, God. Good S. I only no, that wasn't SDI. That was just able to roll after being jabbed. But we got tech chase. Yeah, that's just if you buffer it. Yeah. But yeah, if you buffer like a, a, a direction off of a jab reset, you always roll. Dude, I'm. T I, well, I wish PPMD was here. I'm really tired. But he was obviously really tired too. And we all know PPMD. Nah, PPMD. PPMD is his own man. He can do his own thing. I love PPMD. I do too, man. And apparently the chat does too. Kappa, Craigasm. You're the one that trolled him, not me. I know, dude. It was my idea. I'm not it was lie. your idea. It was my idea. So, sorry about that, boys. Oh, that's I still, I still that's love it. you all. Um, that's it. Y'all might hate me, but that's okay. That's Damn, three stock for K. That was looking a lot better for LXIX, but I think that. Uh, Yo, is that Prog though? Prog, Prog, Craigasm, Prog, Pog Champ, Pog Champ, Prog. Pog Yo, shout out to Prog. Um, it's always good to have you supporting us in here, my friend. Dude, it's so cool seeing like 12 year old kids with like their parents, you know. I know, look, right? Look at the camera, dude. I look. Yeah. See, you see the dad watching his kid, dude? Yeah. I know, that's so cool. I feel like that's the kind of thing that like 10 years ago you wouldn't have seen at all. Like, not even a little bit. You're gonna go play games? You're gonna go play games? I Man, but I, I honestly, I got a feel for these parents at a certain extent. Because, like, can you imagine in the downtime just like waiting around at the tournament as like the only person over 40? That would be a rough time. Prog champ, yeah. <laughs> Everyone spam your prog champs in chat. Prog champ. All right, so once again, like it starts off relatively similar. Like LXIX is doing well, doing Fox stuff, um, doing some, you know, decent nair approaches. Um, when I watch Tyler, I think his main movement is like, bah, main problem is movement. Holy crap! <laughs> his main movement his is main problem. His main movement is problem. <laughs> oh, well, if he down aired again, that would have been really nice, actually. You yeah, got like double dare. Dynasty. Oh man, Tyler having trouble getting off the edge, or LXIX, my bad. <laughs> <laughs> oh oh man, I'm not gonna. I can't say. I'm it. not gonna respond to what comment I was laughing at. Um, so, we're looking for, uh, right now, looking for a grab. LXIX needs uh, up throw up air, or like a nice little read up smash to finish this off. But K, oh man, stop taking a place. Did you know what? I think the fourth tech in place would have been good. I don't know if K would have covered uh, it. Uh, no. I or, think, think K was being stubborn too. I, I have a problem. I tech in place all the time. Yeah. Well, according to SFAG, Canadians tech in place way too much. So, uh, I believe it. Oh man. Take your free punishes. And run. Literally run away from Sheik. Yeah. Ooh. We don't like dash attack at that percent. Um, Back air gets him off stage. Good side B straight to oh, the edge, but no. he's gonna have oh, trouble here. No. Simple. That's just simple, especially when like that that direction is decent when they uh, have taken the edge from you and like kind of you're trying to trick them up with it. But K was just waiting there, so that made that uh, recovery option really really tough uh, or really easy for K to deal with. And like, there's almost no way LXIX would survive.
Yeah. Or we can just start calling him 69 too, if we want nah. to say less syllables. We use Ford. We use. No, nah, not really. No, this uh, this channel has a mature content marker on. Oh, okay. Yeah, dude. So I'm pretty sure we can. Well, yeah, no, I, I I'm not gonna break. No, no, I'm, not, yeah, no, I'm not gonna like. I'm not gonna like mess with Canada Cups things. Uh, we, we we still thank them for putting this on. And, what not? You but know what? Because it's FGC. Maybe 69 should have gone Falcon. We all know Falcon beats Sheik, man. That's true, man. Air wobbles to rest. Can't stop it. <laughs> she clearly is so dumb, dude. <laughs> I'm kidding. You, th that, kind of. that was written by your doppelganger. Who? Ladandis. Your He's doppelganger, not my doppelganger dude. Yo. I look like Silent Wolf no. and PC Chris. I, I'm gonna like tell like you a, right a now. A little fatter version of him, kind you of. You look like you. You look more like Ladandis than both of those guys. Nah. I whatever, man. Like, dude, I, I saw him. I walked up to him and almost tapped him on the shoulder at the big house venue because I thought he was you. I like well, I followed him around for a bit. I was like, oh, hey, there's Cena. And then I was like, <laughs> no, that's actually with Andis. Never mind. Oh, my God. Please. Both play Sheik. Both play lame. Who are these guys? Oh, I love those needles. Oh, that's that easy it. back air. Tech would not have even mattered. 2-0. All right, what do we got? We just got that last kill. Crunch. Got to respect those needles. Can we start the, like 18 plus now? No, we're not doing 18, 18 plus. That's uh, that doesn't sound appropriate at all. Is this for real? What do we got here? We got Quigs oh, versus. Oh no, we got Quiggles. I cannot tell who's wearing the fox. Mask. Is that? Is that? Is who? Who is it? If who is chat, it? Chat, please help me. There's a fox in the venue. Chat. Yeah, I do look like a dog. Okay, you're right. Yeah, they a do. Bit. Yeah, he does. Yeah, they know he looks like Latandis. I told you, man. They want it. This is my the Big Lebowski cosplay. If you're wondering, if you have, if you don't know what that is, uh, you might be born after like 1994. Um, look it up if you haven't seen it. It's a classic cult comedy film starring Jeff Bridges. Only a little bit, yeah. Now that, dude.